It's the weekend in Paris and the neighborhood of La Gaudio, also known as Little Africa, is bustling with activity. Little Africa's main market is lined up with vendors selling fresh fruits and vegetables, stores specializing in African prints, and salons that specialize in styling African hair. This place has been a magnet for people from all walks of life looking for a taste of Africa in Paris, and it's all thanks to Cameroonian-born entrepreneur Jacqueline Ngompi. I've spent more time here in France rather than in my country of origin. It's true that I keep both. I'm always navigating between the two, and I think that today, our generation doesn't want to fight anymore in a dual world of you're either French or you're African. The idea of Little Africa came in November 2014 after Jacqueline first tried and failed to set up an actual travel agency. Today, Little Africa Guide has a website and offers tips on where to visit, tours to traditional African wax textile shops, and the best restaurants serving different African cuisines. Jacqueline launched a crowdfunding project to raise money for a written guidebook which was published in November. I actually found myself making itineraries for lots of people. And finally, when I would also present the online digital guide, people's first reaction was, where can I get the guide? Because it's so great. I definitely think it's a good way for those who are interested in getting to know Africa in Paris to have a lot of places to visit and all the information they need. So it's kind of like an encyclopedia of African businesses in Paris. So it's great. Jacqueline says she hopes her guidebook will also be used by tourism professionals and travel agencies in future as a reference to respond to the needs of their African clients. Nolmakugu, CCTV.